Stefan Wissner. Problem glasögon. Mm-hmm. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> that was number four uh, for this competition. Yes. Uh huh. Mm-hmm. So tell me a little bit about this year that you you have done. Ah, uh, yeah, it was a uh, hmm, crazy season, I would say so, because I had some problems at the beginning of the year. Our nationals, uh, I ended up with the last jump, that was the final, uh, with an outside landing, not even having, hitting the tuffet. Uh, yeah, it was strange for me, but I thought, okay, maybe better now than on the World Championships. And yeah, the World Championships went quite good. And so I said, okay, it had to be <laughs> there <laughs> right. to be later uh, on the first place. Yeah. Right. Maybe <laughs> because you have done over 9000 jumps and per <laughs> see uh, it can always happen even if you are if you have the best performance Absolutely. sometimes it is a bit of luck yeah right. Right, because uh, of weather conditions yeah. how many years have you been doing accuracy um for i started in 1997 my education for skydiving and yeah from 1998 uh, yeah i trained a little bit and from uh, 2000 on I was a professional sportsman in skydiving. Yeah, 2004 was my first uh, World Championships with the yeah, national team of Germany and uh, yeah, since then I was a constant uh, member of uh, the team. Yeah. Right. Tell me a little bit about the difference between military competitions and civilian ones. Mm, the difference is not so big because uh, yeah, this year we had the situation, we had two uh, World Championships, one uh, was military one, one was the civilian but uh, at the end it's almost uh, the same because the people who are in front who are the best they are mainly from the military so yeah it's just another name yeah <laughs> and um, yeah the, the other difference is that on the military world championships we have three disciplines including four-way uh, formation uh, style and accuracy and on uh, civilian world championships we have no form- uh, f- formation yeah. mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, and you're gonna do a uh, Dubai uh, championship as your last championship this year right yes yeah. mm-hmm. will be my last competition right. yeah. and I heard that you're gonna do a, do a 10,000 jump there yeah I try to I still have to do some about 30 jumps uh, to be able to do it in Dubai then uh, right. I hope the weather will be fine in the next weeks so. right. yes do you plan to ah. dominate the world uh, <laughs> as long as my knees uh, go with me as long as my back <laughs> goes with me uh, yeah I, I'm still at the moment, yeah, I like it, of course, very much. If you are successful, it's easy <laughs> to like it. Yeah, but uh, as long as my body right. is fine, I try to proceed. You yeah. Do extra, uh, how do you call it? Um, training. In the uh, yeah, strength training. Of course, it is very important. Sometimes you fall off from five meters or more, and you have to be prepared for that. Otherwise, the spine will be <laughs> broken in some jumps. Yeah. So I wish you a great uh, ending of the season in Dubai, and hope you will beat your personal record. <laughs> and uh, wish you all good luck, and hope to see you in Sweden next year. 225 points, Stefan Wiesner, Germany. And at this moment, I would like to say well done, Stefan, for the great season 2014. He is not only the winner of World Cup, but he's more time to world champion this year with the team alone and so on and so on. Bravo, Stefan. Well done. Second place.